Hi everybody, let's talk about metadata in ArcGIS Pro. So metadata is information about your data. So what we uh, use metadata for is to find out things like where that feature class came from, when it was created, by who, has it been edited, what reference system is it in, etc, etc. All that important uh, information we know in order to use our data correctly. So metadata is usually added by the user and we can check to see if any of our existing data sets in our Utah project has metadata simply by right clicking on the feature class and we can go down to the view metadata section. And in the view metadata section it'll tell us a whole bunch of information. For instance here uh, in the metadata tab it tells us the type. We've got some tags which will help us search for that information, summary descriptions, usage limitations, uh, and the extent of the data set uh, boundaries. And that's through the properties in your contents pane. You can also find out about metadata in your project if you go to the catalog pane and open up your file geodatabase, find the feature class in question and right click on it and go view metadata. And here we'll show you the same information that you had before in uh, whatever type of metadata is added. So it's really important to have metadata associated with your feature classes. If none exists, we can add some ourselves manually. So what we will do first is we will set a metadata standard in which to use and this will define some uh, uh, restrictions and some guidelines in how to add metadata correctly so that it is easily readable by the end user. So in order to set my standard, I'm going to go to the project tab on my project and I'm going to go to options, select options, and then in the uh, project pane here you will see a section called metadata. You're going to click metadata and here you will select the particular specification that will guide you in adding metadata correctly. So we're going to use the ISO 19139 standard, uh, select that and then go ahead and then say OK. Now that sets the standard for this project. I'm going to go back into my project and I'm going to take a look at one of the feature classes that I would like to add or edit data metadata for. So in my file geodatabase, I'm going to add some metadata for my counties layer. So I will select counties, I will right click on it, and I will go to edit metadata. And in this edit box here, I can see that I've got a lot of uh, empty spaces, so I'm going to fill those in. So you have a title, you can add some tags in which to search by, things like county, maybe the state name, etc. As many uh, of these keywords uh, that relate to your data set is good. You can give it a, a summary as well and a description also. Finish your description and then finally add in some credits to source your data so we know where it came from. And if you have a website, uh, it's good to add that in too. So uh, as, as well, you can add in new uh, additional information about your data set if you like. You can change up the scale range uh, to apply to only certain scales and uh, you should have an extent for the bounding box for all of your limits. And when you are finished, don't forget to click save and that should update your metadata in your file geodatabase. And you can go ahead and check it if you close this down after you've saved it. You can right click on your Utah uh, counties layer and go view metadata, the stuff that you just added, select the feature class and there should be your information that uh, has been updated in your metadata section. That's how you can edit metadata. Thanks for watching. Bye now.